Hi everyone, in this video we are going to learn how to construct a line in AutoCAD. For that, there is a command for line after setting the page. L-I-N-E, line. Specify the first point, I'm just going to specify the first point. After specifying the first point, you can give the length of it. The length of it, uh, let it be 70. Enter. Now you can see these an icon also here. You can use that also for using line instead of using line command. You better use line command. The shortcut for line command is L enter. Specify the first point. I'm just clicking on the desktop. If you're not seeing this uh, a horizontal or a straight vertical line. There is a command ortho f8 for ortho the ortho mode is on when the ortho mode is on the line will rotate at an angle of 90 degrees give the length of it the line let it be 100 100 press enter and this line is of 100 mm if, if you have to draw a rectangle by using line command you can draw it, it's very easy. Let's specify the first point, let it be 90. I'm taking 10 mm again 90. Now you can read here, specify the next point or bracket close slash undo. If I press C, enter it will close. If I press U, it will go one step back, undo one step back. I press U, it has gone one step back, and again giving 90 mm. And now I'm pressing C. You can see C, enter. Now you have made a rectangle. Now if you have to make an inclined line by using line command, L enter. Remember that in AutoCAD the angle goes in this direction 0, 90, 120, 0, 90, 180, and so on. So I'm using line command shift less than give the angle I'm giving 30 degrees 30 give the length of the line it is 90 enter now you can check the dimension the angle will be 30. Now, I'm going to return this. Now, if I, <coughs> if I have to take an angle in this direction, L, enter, specify the any point, I'm just specifying any point, shift less than, we know that the angle from the angle in AutoCAD is 0, 90, 180. So I can give 120, 150 as so on, 120, I'm giving 120, 120, so this, this line, this angle will be how much? It would be 60, length of it will be just click on the desktop, you can check the dimension, this dimension will be 60 this will be 120 or else you can or else you can just use line command L enter specify the point I'm just specifying any point shift less than minus 60 now you can check it by going to the dimensions it would be 60. <coughs> if I'm going shift less than, I have to take an angle at the lower right side, shift less than, negative sign and give the angle, let it be 45.
I'm using any line command. If I have to give angle at the lower left side, shift less than without any negative sign, just press it. 60. You can check the dimension. It's 45 or 135. I'm pressing a space bar to go to my previous command. My previous command was dimensions and angular. Remember one thing here. If the angle, if you're going at the upper right side, shift less than, use the command L enter, shift less than, just give the angle and press enter. You will get an angle here. If you're going at the lower right side to this uh, then press shift less than press the negative sign and then give the angle if you are going at the upper left side shift less than negative sign and then give the angle if you are going at the lower left side shift less than just give the angle without any negative sign and press enter after that give the length of the line so positive, positive, negative, negative. That's all for line command. Thanks for watching.